Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Twin Flame Freedom. Today we are doing a beautiful life purpose card reading for the entire Twin Flame Collective Consciousness. Uh, we are working with three different decks today. We've got our Life Purpose Oracle Cards by Doreen Virtue. This is a really uh, like beautiful, colourful deck. This says, is your life purpose? Beautiful and colourful. And we're also working uh, with... Uh, so we've got two cards from that deck. We've got one card from the Archangel Michael uh, Oracle card deck, also by Doreen Virtue. Uh, Archangel Michael uh, knows the specific details of, of everyone's life purpose. So that's uh, why we're working with him today. And then the final card we'll be pulling is from the Angel, uh, Angel of Abundance Oracle card deck. Uh, by Doreen and Grant Virtue. So obviously like your life purpose is full of wealth, it's full of abundance and as you deepen into your life purpose uh, your abundance grows. Okay so uh, the first card we've got here is children. Uh, your life purpose involves helping, teaching and healing children. So yeah like no matter what you do uh, no matter what you do for your career, for your life purpose, you're serving other people, you're serving children, you're serving God's children, you're serving all the children uh, of the planet. And your purpose involves healing children. So no matter what you're doing, whether you could be like um, an artist or you could be like um, a, just like a general like, school teacher or a daycare um, attendant or a train driver uh, how can you in whatever you're doing uh, love deeper and refine deeper in your career to better serve uh, the children that you're designed to serve second card we've got here today is says justice your career brings fairness and protection to others who need your help mm. yeah so what I'm what I'm actually getting from this one is like justice to who you are like uh, really honor honor your heart and bring justice to yourself here um, like follow your heart in regards to what you desire to do with your life what you desire to create. Uh, bring justice to that, that part of consciousness and make the choice to honor your heart and you know create the space for everyone else to do that for themselves. Um, don't uh, settle for something that isn't in alignment with who you are. Bring justice and really like claim your life purpose. Like this this angel here, she's really like honoring herself. You can feel, like she is she is her true self. She's honoring who she is. Um, like there's no question about it. She is in alignment with who she is. So just bring justice to your life purpose here. Honor, honor your heart, honor your feelings. Do what makes, makes you happy. Even if it means just starting small. And you hear it all the time, but it's because it's a really important message and it has a lot of value and uh, wisdom behind it. And it also says that your career will bring fairness and protection to others who need your help. Like when you uh, claim who you are and follow your true life purpose, you're truly going to help the people that you know, you're designed to help. And you're truly going to love them and, and look after them. Because you're in alignment with how you created and what you were designed to do. It's very easy for you to provide service there. So we're moving over to uh, the Archangel Michael Oracle deck. And this card says, write about your thoughts and feelings. Hmm. Thank you for helping me tap into my God-given creativity and wisdom so I can clearly express myself and glean insight, blessing and healing. Yeah, that's it, right? So like when you are in alignment with yourself, you're naturally providing healing to the world because you're naturally going to be loving what you're doing. 
are naturally going to be passionate about what you're doing. And as you share that, you're going to provide love and healing to the world. And write about your thoughts and feelings. This is really just asking you to uh, honor who you are and share that. Uh, share your heart uh, with the world. Like, and it's not like, it doesn't have to be like some like woo-woo. Like, you can put in logical action steps to share your heart with the world. Really get clear here. So, like, if you want to be, uh, if you want to be, like, a hairdresser and you want to share the love of, like, making people feel good with with how their hair is cut, like, well, what's the next uh, physical step you need to take to make that happen? Maybe it's just, like, watching some YouTube videos of, like, hairdressers, like, something as simple as that. But that feels really good to you, right, if that's at the core of your heart. And just begin to, like... Take those steps and honor that part of yourself so that you're creating that space to share who you are with the world. And also, like, if you want to, like, journal to get clear, like, do that too. Like, write about what you love. Write about what's made you happy. Help help yourself get clear there. Like, what made you happy when you were, like, living... uh, what made you happy? What were you doing? And that will point you in the direction of your service to the world. So the, uh, the final card is from the Angels of Abundance deck. And it says, it is safe for you to receive. The more you allow yourself to receive, the more resources you have available to share with others. Open your arms to receive and be a conduit for good coming to you and through you as it blesses the world. Mm. yeah so like don't block out this message of like following your heart like you've blocked it out for long enough it's it's really safe to receive who you are it's really safe to receive this message of that it's safe to follow your heart and and to take steps into uh what makes you happy and to live in alignment with how you created and as you open your heart to receive that you're opening you're going to be supported in that. You're opening yourself up to receive support in that. Because who you truly are is fully supported by creation. Is fully supported by God in the universe. Because they created you to serve in that way. They created you uh, as a unique divine being to offer your gift to the world. And that when you open up and begin walking in that direction, they're going to fully support you. So let go of any resistance you have and let yourself receive and you can see like she's living her purpose she's uh like providing service and uh, and this little body here is receiving but she's also receiving by giving it a gift she loves what she does look how peaceful and satisfied she is in doing this how like supported she is like look at her environment it's so beautiful and divine and supportive and she's got an abundance of apples here for both her and uh, who she's offering them to. Um, so yeah, it's safe for you to follow your heart and to receive uh, receive who you truly are, right? You don't need to block out who you truly are. Good. What a beautiful uh, what a beautiful like a message today. With some really beautiful cards. These are some of my favorite, most uh, common decks that I use. So I hope this uh, helped you. Uh, gave you insight and awareness to next steps on your life purpose journey and thank you for watching and I'll see you in later video